Guys, we are at our first port. We just got off the biggest ship in the world and we are here in Labadee, Haiti. So if you want to see what to do, what it looked like, what to do with your kids, stay tuned for this vlog. Stay tuned. Oh. Oh man, we are in Labadee, Haiti. Wow, this place is gorgeous. Okay guys, this place says water of the sea. Oh yeah, wow. Look at the size though. Yeah, sheesh. Sheesh. Oh, sheesh is right. That's huge. This is huge than all the ships. This is the biggest ship in the world. I think there's a hundred groups. There's way more than a hundred rooms. Fifty thousand for a hundred and fifty. It holds like seven thousand people. What the? More. You more? How much? Almost nine. Oh, that's right. Nine thousand. Nine thousand. Wow. All right, guys. So the the gangway is not very long. The ship, however, super long. Right. I mean, it's. I don't know if these videos are doing it justice. Uh, standing outside this ship, it hits different. It hits different. Am I right? It is, that's what I said. I was putting on Instagram and walking underneath it. I was like, this is a monster ship. Like, right. I just huge. don't know if the videos are really going to do it justice, guys. But wow. So you walk down the gangway over there. You come down. The walkway is here. And that's where you enter. So as you can see, it's not too bad for my people who need a little extra help. They're, oh, perfect timing. They have guys here with the wheelchairs to give you a hand. So you can get help if you can't make it down the gangway. You could always look out for someone like that. So um, yeah, so that's definitely, definitely good. Really and, easy to get to. Right, and since we always talk about cruising with kids, it's good for you to know, parents, that you do not have to book an excursion with your unvaccinated kids for Labadee Hayes. Yes. Even if they, like, they gave us a paper in, in Fort Lauderdale and had us confused, as you guys saw on our first vlog. If you didn't see that, go back and check it out on, on our embarkation day. Mm -hmm. But here we are. We didn't hit uh, book an excursion, and we got off with the girls. Just right. Fine. And you can see there's other kids going down there. So, yes, you can come out here and not book an excursion and have a free 99 day with your kids because there's other days you're gonna have to pay for an excursion so let's yeah. let's let's start this free 99 day we like free 99 let's roll let's roll Well, <laughs> right and early running into the family. Just kill the beans right here. Thank you. Know, I said the same thing myself. I'm like, wow, I did a good job. How did I do that? Y'all did that. Yeah, you know, and they said we've been together for so long, we yeah. always like, what would our kids look like? Yeah. You know, we're like, yeah. God, dog. Right here. We did good. In, in the flesh. Okay, thank yep. you. In the flesh. All right, guys. They, they, I like this because you could get off the ship and get the towels. Right. You don't have I like to that worry about like dragging them in your bag. Oh, did I bring it? Go back to the room and get the towels. Very classy. Very classy. Very cool. Well thought out. Very well thought out. Yes. We appreciate that. So we got our four towels. Just give me a room number, and now we right. are on our way. All right. All right. So the first stop is the Dragon's Cafe. <laughs> we ready to get a bite to eat. No one ate since we got off the ship. So, let's grab a bite to eat. 
Maybe I should go find All right, guys, so we are at Dragon's Cafe. It opens up at noon. So when you get off the ship, you have two hours to eat your food because it closes at 2 o'clock. Okay, so 12 to 2. 12 to 2, and we're going to see what they have. Right. I forgot that they serve you. So, <laughs> may I please she have tried to, Did she try to touch the food? <laughs> no, I tried to touch the plate. May I please have some pineapple, two slices, What's that? Yellow watermelon, right? Honeydew? Honeydew, honeydew. right. Oh, no, I don't care if honeydew. Can I have two slices of watermelon, please? You don't know what honeydew is? That's some class. Okay. So, as you guys can see, it's this disposable paper plates and forks. So right. Rich is going to grab himself one. I'm going to grab an extra one for the girls for them to share. And I'm going to grab a little small one to separate their little food on. Right, right. For the little bird eaters I have. All right, guys. So they have a pasta salad with cherry tomatoes, a watermelon and feta and cheese salad. That actually looks really tasty. American potato salad, which is like, I had the potato salad upstairs at, on the um, boardwalk and it was delicious. Slamming? Slamming. So over here, guys, it's burgers, hot dogs, rice and beans, and corn on the cob. Simple. Barbecue food. Right. You want a hot dog? Can hammer? I get a hot dog, please? All right. So today they have some Creole chicken, seafood rice, some pork ribs, and baked macaroni and cheese. Those are your selections. Of All right. So here is how it's looking. Here's the views. Check this view out to eat. Not too bad, right? And do you guys see this zip line over here? This zip line goes all the way back up there. And if you would like to see what that looks like, you're gonna have to follow AK Adventures. She's she's got her mouth full right now, so it's a little bit embarrassing. I'm sorry about that. But Aaron's not good, so <laughs> I'll just keep the camera on him. Follow them and they will you'll see the footage of how, how crazy that zip line was. Was it fun? Oh, I'm still asking you questions while your mouth is full. I'm sorry. <laughs> so, eat your food, eat your food. So guys, yeah, follow them and you, you, you'll you be able to see what that looks like. So, views are amazing. We're also here. Patty and Terry made it off the ship. What's up, guys? What's up, what's up? Beach so, barbecue. It's, it's a, a beach, beach barbecue, barbecue, guys. Okay. What is it's, it? It's a beach barbecue. If you know, you know. It's a beach barbecue. <laughs> When you come to the beach, they do have the clamshell uh, beach tents, 
for you to rent, it's $50 for two. But they did say since we have small kids and we wanted to put them in there, that'll be fine if you have small kids like us. It's $50 if you want to lay out. But I noticed where the clamshells are, um, the, the water is more rough. Mm -hmm. it's not like some place you would want to play with your smaller kitties. Whereas on the opposite side, in which we're about to go to now, is more calmer water. They do have a tram if you don't feel like walking, because it is a lot. It's a, bit, a lot bigger than I expected. Way um, bigger. Um, they have a tram that can trolley you around. Can tram you. Trolley. Mm -hmm. Thank you. They're kind of in the middle where the, where the trolley drops you off there. There's a splash pad area. What do you I think, Rain? Go ahead, Rain. Rain, keep your shoes on. Those are water shoes. Okay. All right, guys, so as you see, we are gonna go to Columbus Beach because that's supposed to be a way more calm. So if you got young kids and you're worried about the waves, we recommend Columbus Columbus Beach. Not Adrenaline Beach, because that just does it. Adrenaline Beach just does not sound kid friendly, now does it? So you get off on a tram, drops you off right here. And then you take a walk on down. Maybe this is not Columbus Beach. Maybe it's Nellie's Beach. And they've got music, like live music, in several locations. So back there, we talked about, we told you about the prices and we will check the prices here and let you know. All right guys, so here, Nellie's Beach is the one you're looking for. And all these chairs are actually completely free. So you just need to find yourself a cool location. Right, it makes no sense. So if you want a clamshell on the other side, you're gonna pay 50 bucks, whereas these are free 99. We told you it was gonna be free 99. We still have a good two hours here, but because we're not the first ones in, and all these are free, you can actually get like we got a chair right in the front so right next to our kids so we don't have to stay in the water we can actually we could actually sit right there and check them out in the water and Daddy. as you see i'm coming okay. i'm coming okay bring the water camera and there's some cabanas on both sides which those look very cool you gotta book those ahead of time. I'm sure you can book them here too if there's any reservations left. And look at that, the cruise ship in the back. The world's largest cruise ship.
Alright guys, so as you see, the girls have been playing in the water and the waves here is so calm. There's really, there's really not a lot of waves at all, so. Girl, if you get mud in this camera. So yeah, I was just explaining that isn't it nice and calm here? It's perfect for little kids. Yes, nice and calm. They also do the mats. They do the mat rentals. You can just lay out on the beach mat as you right. guys can see the people out there. Yeah. They have the lots of, all these cabanas are sold out, but you can rent a cabana. The cabanas are beautiful. Oh, really nice. They're really perfectly located. Right. On the rocks, on the sides. Definitely. I like that a lot. And look, the cabanas, you could just take the stairs down and walk into the water. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Now, I do not know the pricing of it, but I'll get some information on that. Maybe, if I found out, it'll be on this vlog. So a question that I always want answered when I'm watching other people's vlogs when they are on vacation is, does your child need a floaty, especially if they don't know how to swim? Um, and yes, this is good water for floaties, and Royal Caribbean actually does provide floaties here at this uh, private island. They have a stand over there full of floaties for the kids. You see the kids with the life vest on? Rain and Royce said they're going to be just standing here, but I'm about to go get them a floaty, okay? Right. So always safety first, and just, it just makes it feel a little bit better once they got the vest on. Right, of course. So I'm going to go There's another the question that is frequently wondered about, yes. and the question is, would you recommend water shoes? Um, for this beach. For this beach, I, I don't say think, no. I don't think you need them. It's not a necessity. So the if you're waters, coming to this beach, you don't need to pack yeah, water shoes. Right. It's not big rocks and everything. No. In water. It's like no rocks. Yeah. And so, this one. Even though I have mine on, I just don't take them off. You don't need them on. There you go. What happened to you? You took a drink of water? Okay. All right, guys. So from the beach here, you can walk right over, and there's a, a nice cold bar because the parents. Need a drink. Something cold. In case you're wondering, you can you use your key, your um, room key, room card. So paying here, you don't need to have cash. You can use the card from the ship. So that's always good too. It's nothing like a private island. I know it's not a private island necessarily. It's more of a private part of the country. But um, when you got these private locations, it's great because you could just get off and not think about extra cash and all that you just get off and you can buy what you need in terms of um you know drinks and snacks and all that good stuff so that's pretty sweet to go to the bar and use the ship card guys i just got a lava doozy they come around with drinks this is 12 dollars, and you get to keep the cup this is a nice souvenir cup mm -hmm. and it's a frozen beverage and he uh, poured some rum into it right and they come around so you do actually don't have to go to the bar mm -hmm. they'll come around and bring nice you these straw. i'll be using this for the rest of my trip and it's called what again? A labadoozy. Labadoozy. And it's a doozy. It's a doozy? <laughs> it's a it's a labian? All strawberry banana? Strawberry and strawberry and tropical. Oh, it's like a tropical strawberry. Alright. Well, enjoy. Thank you. Thank you so much, Junior. Nothing like chilling here when you got that front row. And double fisting. Wow. That's how you giving it up? That's how I'm giving it up. I'm on vacation. Vacation life. All right, and the girls are over here playing. And if you look closely in the background, guys, you'll see that Kyra has Aaron filling, filming a full movie back there. It's probably going to be on TikTok, I would imagine. So follow them on TikTok, AK Adventures. But she's making that man work. Look at this. Look at this. Right, and check out the Instagram. Mm-hmm. Right, because look at look look. I can't wait to see this because look at look at what she has him doing. Look look look. Oh, he's directing. He's directing. Okay. Oh, he's saving her. He's saving her. I think she was about to drown or something. Okay. This is. I should put them in uh, influencers on the wild in the wild. Do you guys follow that page? In influencers in the wild it's basically a page that people capture influencers oh my god this guy is this guy is amazing he stopped to fix to fix his wife's hair Aaron he Aaron you better than me dog 
right? Hey, Matt, at his. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is this is some this is this is what marriage is about in the life of a uh, okay. Right. They're doing their thing. So we won't let we won't we won't let them do their thing. We won't check out that reel later. <laughs> <laughs> guys so we are back in our room our uh, room store I feel like we didn't put on YouTube what the bed looks like at night but we will we will tonight we will tonight um, but our room store transformed the bed back into a couch mm -hmm. and that's what we're sitting on right now in our interior room go back and check out the room tour so you guys see what the whole entire room looks like mm -hmm. so we it was our first time in Labadee Haiti and it was a very nice port. Very nice. Very nice port. Um, you I, can do some things, right? Like excursions and stuff like that, or you can do nothing. You can do nothing, mm -hmm. and every, they have lunch, complimentary. Mm -hmm. uh, they do have like Kool Aid. The, the seen, drinks are only Kool Aid and water. Kool Aid and water. For and you might need to put some water in the Kool Aid. The Kool Aid was so sugary. Yeah, which if they mix it like that, it's fine because the water's right next to it, so right. you can water it down. Right. Uh, they have lots of uh, bars and people coming around mm -hmm. serving you drinks if that's something that you want or if you have the drink package it does work off the ship um, and I thought it was a pretty a pretty nice little beach island I would absolutely go back yeah. definitely yeah. would go back if I had to choose the port you know I, I could add that to the list I would definitely add that to the list I liked it it was um, a lot better than um, some private islands that we have been to. Oh yeah. So um, definitely, if your cruise is going to Labadee, Haiti, don't feel like don't oh, skip it. Yeah, don't yeah. skip it. Or I'm gonna stay on a ship. It's a nice beach day. Yeah. It's a very nice beach day, and, and we enjoyed it. You could spend a lot, or you could not. It's mm -hmm. up to you. Um, we did it. We got two kids. They had a great time. Rain, did you have a good time? Yep. Sorry. <laughs> choked them on spit um, they they had a good time we had a good time it did not cost us anything so except for the the beer and the, the beer um, drink. and that so uh, that was good. Yeah, we <laughs> that's all and that we, had we purchased time. yeah we had a good time we spent some um good times with uh AK Adventures and Addy and Terry mm -hmm. check out their channels to see what they did in Labadee Haiti yep. because their video is going to be completely different than ours right so check them out I know um they both did an excursion they actually paid yeah. for something so go out and check out their channels to see exactly what they did while they were in Labadee Haiti yep. so you can see the difference between just chilling or paying to do mm -hmm. something yeah um so yeah that was cool would recommend would definitely return and uh, we can't wait to see what else uh, this inaugural sailing of the ones of the seas, the world's largest ship, has in store for us. We are on day three. Um, we've had many vlogs before this, mm -hmm. so please go back and check them out. Leave a comment. Tell us what you think. Ask us questions. We'll be here to help you. If you guys are not part of Melon at Sea on Facebook, join Melon at Sea. And uh, that's pretty much it for this vlog here at Labadee Haiti. Uh, we're going to sign off and uh, guys, please don't forget to give us a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to drop us a comment. And who should they share this with? Friends and family, not our family and not our and, friends. And check out but yours. Life in R&R. And, and check out Life of R&R &R on Instagram and Facebook. I was going to say that. Oh, sorry. Okay. Next time, I'm, do not see. I'm not Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. Instagram and YouTube, Life of r and the girl's channel. We're working on it. We're trying to get 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 more content out that way on, on their channel as well. And uh, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, come back for more if you enjoyed what you see. We got a lot more coming your way on the beautiful wonder of the seas. And until next time, guys. To continue with... A rich... A rich...